everyone and welcome to today's video. Please subscribe below if you have not and please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. So, um, I wanted to try different methods on how to dry and style my curls. I was looking around at what other people do. A lot of people, as I said on my last video last week, last week I used three products. I used um, Infusium Leave-In Treatment. It's a clear treatment and then I put some cream in which is what I prefer and then I used a little gel at the ends. I'm going to kind of do something similar but with different products. Um, I wanted to do like soaking wet which I just don't like to do ever but I'm going to do it for the sake of the videos and I just didn't have time today to do that because that's a whole preparation of my head in the tub and all that so we're just going to do, we're going to try some different products to mix together. So still in the experimental phase. Again, if this is your first time seeing my channel, what I normally do is review products and I review one product at a time. And even when I'm not reviewing products and I'm just on my own, no videos, I still only use one product at a time. It's just, to me, it just makes more sense. It's convenient. I don't know that it really makes a big difference to put in all these different products. Then I feel like I'm wasting them. Um, when my hair comes out pretty much the same, like I use a lot of product, I really do, but I use a lot of one product. Um, so I don't know that it really matters and I make sure that the product that I use I like to have like it's a moisturizing kind of product because I have dry hair so um, but you know a lot I, I do notice curly girls use a lot of different products and it just seems like a long process a lot of steps that I don't have time for I'm like boom 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 get me in get me out gotta get to work except for right now but that's usually why I only stick to one product and I also don't do second day curls really. I just like to refresh my curls every day. But maybe that's also why they do um, a lot of different products so that it'll last for a few days. It's just um, everybody's different, you know? So yeah, um, today what I'm gonna try, I'm going to use from Mizani 25 Miracle Milk. This is a leave-in and it's for all hair types. It nourishes, it has fennel seed oil and uh, coconut oil. So I'm going to start off with that and then I'm going to go in, I'm going to use instead of a cream, I'm going to use the Wee Dad Vita Curl Soft Defining Mousse. This, it's, it's kind of like saying it's a cream but it's light, it kind of will, I'm hoping will give me the lift in a cream moussey because that's a creamy mousse. And then I'm going to go in on the ends with um, Zodo's Professional All About Curl Soft Defining Gel. This is Crunchless, crunchless Light Hold. So, they also have um, a couple other gels, but I'm gonna use the soft one because I hate crunch. Mm. So, let's get into this. Okay, so, starting in with, I do like to do damp hair always. I just, you know, I know a lot of people put their hair, put their products in their hair when it's soaking wet. I just don't agree with that method. I am gonna try it though. I'm gonna try it, I've tried it in one video, I think. Um, didn't make that big of a difference to me. It's just, to, if you want less frizz, you really should get most of the water out of your hair. Oh, too much um, water can cause hygro I can never say this. Hygro fatigue. Hygro fatigue. Um, that's another whole thing that I'm not going to get into, but um, I don't, you know, I'm not an expert, so. Um, but it's it's really good. It works in my hair. I like to damp it, have my hair damp for the most part when I style my hair. So that this way, the product's not fighting against water. You know, the water expands your hair. I want the product to go in my hair and not fight the water. So I personally like to use damp hair. I don't, and besides the fact, soaking wet hair is just so annoying. Like dripping all over your shoulder, all over your clothes, wet. I, uh, uh, mm -mm. Nah, sorry. Not for me. So putting some of this in. So this hopefully will nourish my hair straight away since this is the first product in my hair. Now I'm going to go in with the mousse and I have done um, reviews on this product. We Dead is one of my favorites. I've said it all the time. It's like the first curl product I've really ever used. Like, I don't know, uh, hmm, over 20 years ago. I hate working with mousse though sometimes, it's kind of annoying. 
I also don't like, I'm, it's not that I'm lazy, I just like feel like, I don't wanna say a waste of time, but in a way I kind of feel like it is when you take each set, oh, see this is why I hate most, it drops it all, it's dropping all over. Like some people will take section at a time, separate the hair, and each section will put product in, take a next section, put more product in, like I just, have time for that and honestly the way I do it although right now I feel like I'm not doing it good because it's harder with mousse to kind of but I I'm making sure it gets in each on each piece of my hair I really am like that's what we have fingers for best tools it's our finger um okay like I really do I feel like today I'm not doing the job but I I'll start from here and then I'll I'll go under and as I'm lifting my hair as I get to the bottom I always put on the bottom separately like so and I did actually do a video does it matter if I section my hair or am I just wasting my time and honestly my hair came out pretty much the same as it always does so it's up to you if you like taking each section at a time and doing that by all means go ahead okay um, now I'm gonna go in with the Zoto Professional all about curls soft defining gel um, I noticed a lot of people will Put this on upside down not this particular but we'll put like gel upside down as they're crunching maybe i'll do that um i do upside down hopefully this gets on camera just really being sure to get the ends okay I think by doing that upside down, I'll get that lift I like, so that's good. Um, I can't dry my hair upside down from the beginning because my hair just does not come out good. I like my part, it never knows what to do. That's just my hair. Even when my hair was really long, I don't know, the upside down never worked for me. It just didn't, it made this part look weird. So I wanna start as I normally would and then what I've been doing at the very end is when it's almost pretty much dry, then I'll go upside down and then I'll like scrunch it and I feel like that works out good. So I'm gonna do that. And as always with diffusing, I hardly touch my hair. You know, I'm looking at my curls and I actually, I'm gonna do this. I could see they don't look as defined as I normally do when I scrunch my hair. So let me just, I'm gonna just take a little gel, just a little. Because I like to rake it out first, and I didn't really rake it. And see the difference? Makes such a difference by raking your hair with your fingers. Some people use a Denman brush for that. I like to just use my fingers. I could tell it, it wasn't gonna, it was gonna give me like tiny little non defined curls. Yeah, that looks so much better. I like, I like to rake and shake. Another little trick I learned from Wee Dad and some people think that I'm not doing it right, but I know that I am because that's how they showed me. The thing is, again, it goes back to me not doing it section at a time. Of course, when I go there, they're gonna do each section at a time because they're you're there for the experience. They gotta do it 100%. I'm doing it just really fast, that's all. But I'm still doing that. See, when I do that, see what my fingers do? It separates it. Sort of like what the Denman brush is doing, but I'm just doing it with my fingers instead. That gives you the defined curls and then crunch up. Okay, yeah, that looks better. I was saying before, try not to touch your curls. Like, I have to do this because I want to get it in there, but other than that, don't touch the curls when they're wet. Only let this touch your curls. Okay guys, I am back. Hair is dry, hair is style, hair is big. Hair is big. Uh, maybe you don't see it, but for me it's a lot bigger than it normally is, which I kind of like. I've, I don't know, some days I like my hair big. And 
When I did the three products last week, I really felt like I needed a trim, so I trimmed my own hair. So that's why I also want to try today with a few different products because I felt like maybe, if, and my hair was so much healthier after I just trimmed it. I'm not a professional hairstylist at all. I just, I just cleaned it up a little bit. Whatever I did, it, it did look a little better. So I thought today would be better than last week's video, and I because I wasn't sure if that was the reason why I didn't love the way it looked. Um, I think it looks good. I don't know if it makes a difference. I will say, I can't, I'm just, the one thing that bothers me with gels, and I love the Soda Professional All About Curls Cream. I love that, I use it all the time. But it's any gel, I don't know, I have flyaways. If I touch my hair, when I was drying my hair, like particles everywhere, and that just irks me. And that's gel, that's just what gel does. So, I'll use that cream instead, but the gel, I think what happened is, which is a good thing, this is a good thing, I think this is nourishing my hair, this gave me the lift, the mousse gave me the lift, and the gel gave me the curls too. Um, this also gave me the curls. But like, I think my, my hair feels a little dry. It doesn't feel very moisturized, I, I gotta be honest. Um, I think my curls look, I think my hairstyle looks good. I just, I don't know, my whole point is I don't know if it's worth sitting here and wasting all these products to put in my hair when I know that if I use one product, it can look just as good if I use a little extra of that one product. But definitely the mousse gave me some lift here because my hair is big. It's bigger than usual. I don't know. And I have been doing the upside down at the end, so that does help give it more of a vavoom. But we could do our usual and go throughout the day. It's my daughter's 21st birthday. We've had three quarantine birthdays in this household. My husband's in February, but me and the girls, this was our, we called it our trifecta year. I was turning 50, my youngest was turning 18, did turn 18, and now my oldest is 21. Not my oldest, my middle, my son is my oldest, but the girls, we were having a trifecta. And he's actually gonna be 25 this year, so it's a big year, 2020. As much as it sucks so far, I hate 2020 so far, um, it was a big year that I've always, always thought about. Like I've always thought about this year because I knew I was turning 50, Sophia was turning 18, and my daughter Lena's turning 21. My son's 25 this year. It's weird. It turned out to be the worst year ever. Well, it could be worse. Let's just think of that. So anyway, um, yeah, so we're just kind of hanging out with her. I had to run to the store and get some stuff, but um, you know what I hate? Like, I can't go out without lipstick or lip treatment something on, even if it's clear, I don't care, I have to have some on my lip. But now, like, because I have to wear a mask, I hate it, because my mask, I have to take my lipstick off before I put my mask on, because I'm gonna have lipstick all over my mask. I just hate this. I don't wanna go out ever again until masks are done. Then I'll start going out again, because I hate and despise wearing masks. I can't breathe. I can't wear my sunglasses with it, because my sunglasses are prescription, so I like to see within the store. I'm just a mess. I just am not happy right now. But anyway, um, yeah, so we'll hang out a little and we'll see how well these products lasted. Again, my hair, it does, it looks good, but it's, um, feels dry. I don't know what it is because I put all good products. These are all products that I really like. So again, I think I just like stick into one product. I really do. But we'll see how this turns out just for fun and I'll catch with you in a bit. Okay, so as I always do 20 times a day, I change my clothes because as beautiful out as it is, and it is beautiful, it's spring still. I'm just like, I want summer here because I have no in between. I have sweatshirts and I have spaghetti straps. I have nothing in between and I'm freezing. So I have to put this on. It's all I ever wear. I wear it like every day. Okay, I gotta clean my kitchen right now. So let's go clean. My hair just feels so dry. I'm scared to be near a candle. <laughs> it's so dry. Not moisturized at all. I don't know what happened. Um, too much gel. My hair just doesn't like gel. My hair does not like gel. So, um, okay. We're in the kitchen now. <laughs> I keep like making excuses not to clean, but it's a freaking mess. And when you have children who are older, maybe you don't. Maybe your kids are clean, unlike mine. Maybe your kitchen's not like mine, but mine's a mess every single day. So, I need to clean it up. Let's go.
house is as clean as it's gonna be for now, which is fine. Don't judge me, don't judge me, but when I work, I do have cleaners come every two weeks, and with quarantine, we haven't had them come. Um, when I used to clean the house myself, it was just too much. My whole weekend was taken up by cleaning the house, and like, because I didn't get home every night until like 6.20, 6.30, I had to cook dinner. Like, I'm not gonna clean eight o'clock at night, whatever. It's a, I have a lot of rooms, whatever. So, we do have them come every other week. I have missed them more than I miss anything. <laughs> like seriously miss them and uh they're coming next week no this week he's gonna call me tell me what day i'm so excited i'm like i've been doing my best we have been we take turns whatever but yeah i'm over it i i don't like to i like to keep things clean because then i feel like i can't breathe if the house is not clean and i'm constantly cleaning up after everyone they'll deny it but i do and i have to vacuum gotta get the vacuum for this and this but last time I brought that up my blurry last time I brought that up and vacuum like all over my back went out and two days ago my back really really went out bad my lower back I almost didn't film and upload because of it because I was in so much pain um, thank God that went away in a couple of days because last time that happened to me a few years back no like five years ago like it, it lasted two months. I was going to chiropractic, nothing worked. So I'm so thankful this ended and it was just maybe I just pulled something, I don't even know. But I feel better, it's still a little hurt, but it hurts a little, but I can walk around, so it's all good. And that's it. Oh, I gotta clean that window because little Miss Wilma sits in her window. I put this here. I know it's so unattractive, but like that's a light material and this little girl who it's dark for you right now because you're in front of the window but there we go she will sometimes vomit <laughs> and throw up and the last thing I need is that all over my couch or chair so we did have one on here but finally we're like it just is so ugly I can't take it you can't see the furniture I had these I had two blankets like this all over my furniture what's the point of having furniture so, um, you can't probably see it, no you can't see it, but the window has to be cleaned so bad because she barks and she puts her nose up to it and it's so like, it's got so much stain. So let me go clean that right now. That is all clean. I'm not the best at cleaning windows, I have to admit. Um, yeah, so I put a little blanket there for her. So that she could sit comfortably in the window. Sorry about the bad lighting. I don't know where to go. All good, Wilmy? By the way, we got some 21 balloons. They didn't have the color, let's see. Two of my Amazon deliveries came. One is a 50 box of face masks because the ones I made is just, I don't know. They're not great. They're okay, but they're just too, I don't know. So these are just simple. I'm getting, finally we're able to get them within a week, so I did. And then this is the dress I was talking about the other day. If you saw my vlog for a haul, put your sunglasses on because this is bright. This is just another summer dress to wear around the house, to the beach, by the pool. Not my pool, because I don't have one, but I thought it was nice. Hopefully I will go away and I can wear it then. How's my hair? Still big, big but dry. It feels so dry, I don't like that part. I mean, it probably looks good. It just, again, it, I don't like the way it feels. 
hate it, I hate it. Okay, back to work. Oh, you could see how dry my hair is right here. Look at that. Ew. No, I don't like that. Mm -mm. You see, that's the gel. <clears throat> Terrible. I don't like it. It's probably gonna be in a ponytail tonight, in a couple hours. But in the meantime, I go to the supermarket. These are the toes. Stop eating. I've never worn in my life. We're all eating too so much. Nice. Actually, I'm not eating too much. I'm being good. You guys are eating at midnight full on meals. <laughs> not good. Not me. Quarantine's almost over, and when it's over, you're all going to regret it. Oh my God, no, you guys look good still. All oh right, God, we're going to go to the supermarket. My legs. So what? Nobody's looking at you. I can't even see anything. I it's not like it's as long as the hair on your head. All right, let's go. We gotta buy alcohol. Today's Alina's Yay, 21st birthday. Happy. I changed again. It got hot after cleaning, so I figured this is a good alternative because it's a sweater. It's a sweater and then whatever. My hair looks a little better because I put a little mixed chicks here. It was that dry. It just sucked it right up. So I will check in later tonight. I'm about to cook a meal. We're going to have some appetizers. And um, yeah, so we will, I'll see you later and we'll see. I mean, there's not much to see. I'll just say goodnight later. How about that and see how my hair is. Happy birthday, dear Alina. Happy birthday to you. Make a wish, make a wish. Make a wish. You see two and one and one good for good luck. Yeah, two and one and then one for good luck. Okay. Maybe you should roll that that way so it goes that way. What? 21. Two and one. All right. Yay. Okay, guys. It's late. I'm going to bed. And look, the hair went up. The hair went up. It was just like big, but it looked good. It didn't look bad. Um, but I'm gonna. I'm think I'm done trying a few different products. I don't know. I just think it's like. I don't know. I think like it's pointless. I just use one product and it's better. Um, so we'll try different methods next time. Like I want to try. I always. I already did a video on the Demden brush. I got really crazy curls with that. Like that stayed. Um, I did do like a diva video and I put it in soaking wet and I didn't see much of a difference. Hmm. Oh, the plopping video. I gotta do the plopping video. <laughs> Such a silliness. It's silliness to me, but I'll try it. Why not? And I think that's it. I thought that was gonna have different things. It's just like if I keep trying different products. It's like the same kind of videos, so. Um, look who just like scared the heck out of me. <laughs> me. You scared, she's, but you were probably like, who are you talking <laughs> to? Because like, <laughs> it's like bedtime, just they're hanging out. Okay, uh, you going up? All right, so anyway, yeah. Am I blurry? I feel like I'm blurry. Or weird light, because all the light's off, because we're going to bed now. So, um, ooh, look, I like glow. All right, so don't forget to subscribe. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. And until next time. And until next time, have a good one. Bye, guys.